So I wanted to make a quick vlog uh, to make an announcement that I'm uh, pretty excited to make and pretty excited to do. On April 19th through May 24th, I will have a solo show at Last Rites Gallery in New York. Obviously, this kind of opportunity is something that every artist uh, dreams of, and I cannot be more excited or more committed. I'm naming the show Catabasis. Some people say Catabasis, and some people say Catabasis. An authority on the Greek language at one point was asked, how do you say these ancient words, and he said with authority. So I'm going with the one that I like. It's an ancient Greek word that basically means travel to the underworld or a journey through the interior. The way that I'm going about this is kind of skewed more in the Carl Jung vein. There are places in all of us, phobias, fears, anxieties, that we don't typically like, you know, especially memories that um, you think of them and your whole body will get hot, your adrenaline will get pumping, you know, the darker areas of our psyche, even the obvious ones, the, the conscious ones, um, not to say anything of the unconscious ones. My intention is to go into those areas uh, and bring back images with me and paint those. I'm not exactly sure what's gonna happen with it. I know that doing that uh, will probably cause a great deal of anxiety on my part and a fair amount of change. It's fairly terrifying, but I don't want to do a solo show and have it be, these are a collection of images that I think look pretty. I want the show to actually mean something to me, to there to be, I, I want it to be where I don't have to question whether or not these pieces go together because they come from a, a particular thing that I'm trying to do and that's where the pieces come from. I want the show to truly mean something to me. I think if I expect the show to mean something to somebody else, then it has to be extremely important to me. Again, I don't know. Uh, the result, I'm not sure if people will say that the work looks like me or not. Um, maybe it'll look exactly like what I normally do. I don't, I don't 100% know. And I am terrified. Uh, there are definitely places in my psyche that scare the shit out of me. Trying to go into those areas uh, vividly enough to be able to see things and then come back and paint them. Um, I won't be showing a great deal of the work until the show. I'll, I'll show details of paintings and so forth, but I want people to be able to walk in to Last Rites that night and see most of the images for the first time. But what I will be doing, hopefully, is doing a vlog throughout the whole process to kind of go through and talk about uh, what's going on with me and, and how it's functioning. Um, probably more for myself than anyone else. And to maybe keep some type of sanity involved in it. One of the other things accompanying the show is I will be doing an art book from all the work from the show and it should be available for the first time that night at the show. Again, I have no idea uh, how this is going to go. I've, I've never had a solo show. Um, I feel like in some ways I'm, I'm up to the challenge but again in so many ways I'm terrified about it. Uh, you know, Last Rites is a gallery that's hosted some of the most amazing artists that, that I know of. I mean, Dave Stupakis, Michael Hussar, uh, Matthew Bone. Uh, I mean, the list literally goes on and on and on. I mean, of the who's who of, of, of the art that I truly love. So getting a solo show there is, I, I don't even know how it happened. I, th I think it has something to do with how beautiful my wife is. I'm not exactly sure. But I, I will do the best I can at honoring it and trying to make a show that actually truly means something to me. And thank you everyone out there who supports this and me. Uh, it's amazing to be able to live my life with art. And thank you all so much for allowing me to do that.